I'm Rabbi Warren Elf of the South End and District Reform Synagogue. And many of my community have been very keen to ensure they have, the vac have been vaccinated um, and have all sorts of questions, I think, around um, the vaccinations. Um, one concern I know from a variety of different communities, not so much mine, is that there are concerns about what they've heard about the vaccines and the vaccinations, that they're not safe, there will be side effects, um, what's in it and those sorts of things. Um, so maybe if I sort of ask that question first and uh, hand over to you, thank you. Well, thank you, Rabbi Warren. Um, I'm very happy to uh, reassure your uh, congregation and other members of the public about the vaccines. The vaccines have been tried out, the data has been analyzed independently and verified internationally. And in one short sentence, I can say, it is better to be protected with the vaccines than to take the chance of getting COVID-19 disease. And that better to be protected by the vaccines is many, many, many times over. So having said that, <clears throat> we have known known uh, side effects of the vaccines and the known known side effects with many vaccines, including the SARS-CoV-2 vaccines that we're using are uh, a sore arm, feeling under the weather for a couple of days after the immunization, after the first and the second dose. Not everyone will feel under the weather. Some people do, some people do not. If they do not, it doesn't mean that the vaccine has not worked with them. Some people may get a mild headache. Some people may feel a little bit tired. The unusual, uh, very rare and idiopathic side effects of the AstraZeneca Oxford vaccine is very, very rare in chances of greater than one in a million is a association between blood clots and having the vaccine recently. Having said that, it is very rare. And on the other hand, you could get COVID-19 disease and that itself also produces clots. Also, if you're a smoker on the oral contraceptive pill or you do long haul flights, those are all risks for producing blood clots. So overall, in answer to your question, for the benefit of members of the public, your congregation, it's very simple. The vaccine will save your life. If I were given the vaccine, I would take it without hesitation. I would take any vaccine without hesitation. I would take the first vaccine without hesitation. And, um, I hope this reassures members of the public and your congregation.